What's going on YouTube? Giosno right here. So in today's video we're discussing about the current status of the A12 jailbreak for the iOS 12.1.3 all the way up to iOS 12.4. And of course we're going to discuss which are the best versions to stay on, especially in terms of PAC bypass and you know reliability and stuff like that. So at first a primer on what's currently going on. You probably know that the Uncover will be released with A12 support. Now not a lot has been going on lately because Pound Own was in his vacation so he couldn't work on the Uncover. But the previous release of the Uncover, the version 3.6.0, the previous major release I would say, five days ago, introduced a couple of hints to the A12 and A12X support. They say here, quote, internally prepared jailbreak patches for a full-fledged A12 and A12X support. And then of course they also said in here, internally prepared CDI and its resources for full-fledged ARM 64E support. Now for those of you who are not aware, the uh, iPhone XS, XS Max and XR are called A12 devices and they run the ARM 64E binaries. So what the version 3.6.0 of Uncover actually added for the A12 devices is the foundation for the A12 jailbreak. The binaries have been updated to work on the ARM 64E and of course the patches for the jailbreak have been integrated to actually work on the A12 devices, but still there needs to be more work done. So the Uncover is actively worked on in terms of jailbreaking for the A12, but for the moment we do not have a release. However, the Uncover team is actually very, very close. Unfortunately, I cannot say the same for the Chimera jailbreak. Yes, Chimera has been created primarily with the A12 devices in mind, as you can see from their website in here, which boasts the fact that they were the first to actually jailbreak the A12 devices with a public jailbreak. And yes, this was the first iOS 12.0 all the way up to iOS 12.1.2 A12 jailbreak. However, for the moment, the Chimera does not support the 12.1.3 uh, and newer on the A12 either. From what I know, Coolstar is actively working on the uh, Chimera jailbreak and they are trying to add the A12 support. Coolstar got an A12 device, he said so on Twitter just a couple weeks ago, so he can work on an A12 jailbreak in his spare time. However, since the Chimera is not open source and I do not have access to their private source like I do with the Uncover, I cannot tell you exactly what progress they're making or whether they're making any progress. And there were a couple of questions today about the uh, rootless jailbreak, which has seen a couple of updates for the uh, iOS 12.4 and lower lately, but unfortunately no, the uh, rootless jailbreak does not support the A12 devices. The only supported devices are the A7 through A11, so no A12 in here either. Now, as you probably know, just two days ago, Apple stopped signing the iOS 12.4, and there were discussions back in August that you should stay on iOS 12.4 or you should update your A12 device to 12.4 because apparently the Uncover does not need a PAC bypass anymore. Now, what you should do now that is unsigned? Well, if you're running iOS 12.1.2 or lower, you should definitely stay, never update from that. If you're running 12.1.3 or newer, all the way up to iOS 12.2, you should stay there too, because there is a PAC bypass for these versions. And just in case you want to use the Chimera, which probably doesn't use the same mechanism as the Uncover, you will need a PAC bypass, most likely, and these versions do have one. Now for the iOS 12.3 and 12.3.1, if you're here, you're in pretty serious problem, because these versions do not have a TFP0 exploit. As for 12.4.1, it's a pretty bad firmware to be on, it's the latest one, it fixes the bug left unpatched on 12.4, so we cannot jailbreak it for the moment, so if you're running this version on your A12 device, there will be a long wait before you get a jailbreak, because at first First, we do not have TFP0 for 12.4.1 and then even if we have TFP0, we still do not have a PAC bypass. Now, I would definitely recommend you not to update iOS 13 for the moment when it comes out if you're running 12.4.1. So yeah, that's currently what's going on. The Uncover looks the most promising of all of them because they're basically very, very close and it has already been updated to have basically the framework for an 812 jailbreak. They just have to complete it and release it, which may take a little bit more time, but at least we have information about their progress. So yeah, I would keep an eye on both the uh, Chimera and the Uncover for the moment, and I will keep you updated, of course, on the channel. Till the next time, I'm Geosnow. Thank you for watching and peace out.